Can supplements improve eye health and vision? Overview You've probably heard someone say, eat your carrots, they're good for your eyes. You may have also seen advertisements for nutritional supplements for eye health. Can vitamins and minerals benefit your eye health and vision? Keep reading to learn more about supplements and eye health. Research What science has to say Plenty of claims are made about the positive effects of supplements on vision and eye health, but very few research studies support these claims. One exception is the age-related eye disease studies, ARINS and ARINS2. These are large studies conducted by the National Eye Institute. Results from ARINS2 took what was learned from ARINS and improved the supplement recommendations. The studies focused on two conditions that affect millions of Americans, age-related macular degeneration, AMD, and cataracts. Age-Related Macular Degeneration AMD. AMD is the leading cause of vision loss in the United States. It affects more than 10 million people. It's mainly associated with aging, but some forms of macular degeneration affect younger people as well. AMD occurs when there's deterioration of light-sensitive cells in the macula area of the retina. This is the part of the eye responsible for recording what we see and sending the information to our brains. Seeing fine detail focusing. Cataracts. A cataract is a clouding of the lens of the eye. It may impair your ability to see well enough to perform daily tasks and can become worse over time. Cataracts are extremely common, particularly among older adults. In 2010, 24.4 million Americans were diagnosed with cataracts. Recommended supplements. A Rinse and A Rinse 2 looked at the effects of high doses of several antioxidants taken together for several years. The final recommendations from AREDS2 were Vitamin C 500 mg, Vitamin E 400 IU Lutein 10 mg, Zinc 2 mg Zinc 80 mg, Copper 2 mg, taken to prevent copper deficiency caused by zinc This supplement formulation is available in capsule form and is usually taken twice daily Results Participants in the AREDS2 study took one of four supplement formulations that had been identified as potentially beneficial in the AREDS study. Each participant took the supplement daily for five years. In study participants, the risk of AMD and serious vision loss was reduced by 25% over six years. In people with AMD, the condition was slowed only in people with moderate AMD. Supplements were not effective for people with mild or very advanced stages. Additionally, Supplements used in the study did not prevent AMD or restore vision loss. Lutein and Zeke's and then supplements taken as part of the ARADS2 formulation were seen to reduce the need for cataract surgery by 32% in people who initially had low dietary levels of these carotenoids. The studies were promising and found that there are some benefits to certain supplements, but they won't have beneficial effects in everyone. More research is needed to better understand the connection between supplements and eye health. Supplements what supplements may help my eye health? The following supplements, including the antioxidants found in ARINS2 capsules, have been shown to be beneficial for some people. 1. Lutein and Zeaxanthin Lutein and Zeaxanthin are carotenoids. Carotenoids are pigments found in plants and in your retina. Supplementing these pigments helps increase their density in your retina. They also absorb high-energy blue and ultraviolet light that can damage your eyes. 2. Zinc also found naturally in your eyes, zinc is a powerful antioxidant that protects against cell damage. Zinc is the primary mineral in the ARINS2 formulation. When taking zinc, copper absorption is lessened. It's recommended that zinc be combined with copper supplements. 3. Vitamin B1, Thiamin Vitamin B1 is essential for the health of your eyes. There's evidence that vitamin B1, taken with other vitamins, may reduce your risk of getting cataracts, but more research is needed. Known as one of the anti-stress B vitamins, vitamin B1 reduces inflammation. Initial research also indicates that it may be ineffective for treating uveitis, an inflammatory eye condition that can lead to blindness. 4. Omega-3 Fatty Acids The diet of most Americans doesn't contain enough omega-3 fatty acids the main source of which is fish. Photoreceptor cells in your retina contain a large quantity of omega-3 fatty acid. It's believed that docosahexaenoic acid, DHA, a type of omega-3 fatty acid, helps in the development of retinal cells. It's also thought to have a role in reducing inflammation and helping cells of the retina and the cornea heal and regenerate after damage due to light exposure and aging. 
A number of studies indicate that people who consume more of two omega-3 fatty acids, DHA, and icosapentaenoic acid, EPA, were less likely to have AMD. Low levels of omega-3 fatty acids are associated with dry eye syndrome and retinopathy, a disease that causes progressive damage to the retina. Research has also shown that infants whose formula contains DHA develop better vision than infants not given DHA. 5. Vitamin C Several large studies show that vitamin C reduces the risk of getting some types of cataracts. Two of these studies also found that a combination of vitamin C and E supplements reduced risk for cataracts and slowed the progression of cataracts. Recommendations Do you need supplements? Diet should always be your primary source of vitamins and minerals. However, the National Eye Institute advises that the high doses found in a rinse too can't be obtained from diet alone. In addition to diet and supplements, there are some other things you can do at home to promote eye health. Use a humidifier in your home if your house is dry. You may only need to use it seasonally, or you may need to use it year-round, depending on the climate where you live. Drink plenty of water. Although recommendations vary by weight, adults should drink, roughly, between 1 5 liters, 6 and 1 quarter cups, and 2 liters, 8 and 1 third cups, of fluid daily. Keep your eyes moist with artificial tears. Change your furnace or air conditioner filters regularly. Avoid environments with dusty or dirty air. Use cold compresses, cucumbers, or dampened and cooled green or black tea bags on your eyes. Some people prefer calendula tea. See your doctor. When should you see your doctor? Consult your ophthalmologist before taking a rinse too. An ophthalmologist is a doctor who specializes in eye health. Your doctor will be able to determine if the supplements will be effective, given the status of your eye health. Because the high dosages in a rinse too can interact with other medications and shouldn't be taken by people with certain health conditions, it's important to talk with your primary care doctor, too. Outlook Can I use supplements to improve my eye health? Your eyes and vision are affected by many factors, including genetics and age. Maintaining a healthy lifestyle and eating a balanced diet that contains antioxidant-rich foods can contribute significantly to the health of your eyes. Tips for eye health There are many things you can do to benefit your eye health. Don't smoke. Smoking damages blood vessels in the eyes and can lead to cataracts, macular degeneration, and other sight problems. Protect your eyes from ultraviolet light. Wear sunglasses when you're outdoors and avoid staring directly into bright lights. Maintain a healthy weight and an active lifestyle. After age 60, get a dilated eye exam each year. Make sure your diet contains plenty of green leafy vegetables, spinach, corn, oranges, eggs, yellow carrots. These foods contain high levels of nutrients, including those found in the a 2 formulation. Plus 5 Ways to Keep Your Eyes Healthy 1. Limit Screen Time Staring at computers and other device screens for too long has been known to strain the eyes. To avoid tiring your eyes and causing glassy eye, limit your exposure to looking at screens. Another prevention method is ensuring the screen is far enough away from your face. According to the American Optometric Association, a computer screen should be 4 to 5 inches below eye level and 20 to 28 inches from the eye. The association also recommends resting your eyes once every 15 minutes after two hours of ongoing use of a computer. To rest your eyes, simply look at an object 20 feet away for 20 seconds or longer. Find out more about the 2020 eye rule. 2. Drink more water. Ensuring your body gets enough water per day, at least 8 glasses of 8 ounces of water, is ideal. Here, we break down how much water you really need per day and tips on how to get it. 3. Don't share. According to the National Eye Institute, people should avoid sharing anything that may come in contact with their eyes and spread bacteria or irritants. This includes cosmetics, such as eye makeup and face makeup, eyeglasses or sunglasses, towels, blankets, and pillowcases, eye drop bottles. 4. Wash your hands. Dirty hands are one of the easiest ways to spread germs and eye irritants. If you've interacted with someone with an eye condition such as conjunctivitis, it's important to wash your hands regularly to avoid spreading the condition. People who wear contacts should also wash their hands before putting in or removing contact lenses. 5. Visit your eye doctor. Just as you should visit your general practitioner once a year for a checkup, 
you should also visit your eye doctor annually. These routine visits can help your doctor assess your eye health or catch eye conditions early. These visits can also help you better understand your eyes, what causes symptoms like glassy eyes, and encourage you to build good habits that promote eye health.